Hi, today I'd like to talk to you a little bit about uh, essential oils because I use essential oils a lot uh, when I work with my clients and I think they're very effective. Essential oils offer another alternative treatment for chronic pain. They can be used in massage or in an, in an infuser. They can be rubbed into your muscles and joints or you can breathe them in and use your olfactory system. I typically use wintergreen, eucalyptus, spearmint, and a little camphor oil in my massage oil. This is one of the things that makes my body work a little bit more therapeutic than fluff. I use lavender for people who need to relax and other various different types of uh, essential oils. So I want to read you a little bit from an article from the uh, Alternative Daily that talks about uh, essential oils and their uses. So it begins, life is full of aches and pains, some minor, some major. After a long day, many people find themselves reaching into the medicine cabinet for some aspirin to soothe the daily stress, the headaches, joint pains, muscle aches that come with simply being human. Sufferers of chronic pain may reach for stronger medications, and those of us who are highly anxious may choose sleeping pills just to wind down. Not a good idea. However, these types of drugs are not innocuous and often come with dangerous side effects that accumulate the more we take them. Luckily, nature has a solution. One of the most invigorating and enjoyable natural ways to manage everyday aches and pains, and even serious chronic pain, is the application of essential oils. Essential oils are potent and highly concentrated oils of plants which many of our modern medicines are actually derived from without the added chemical content. Depending on the type of pain and the type of oil, they can be applied directly to pressure points, used in massage, combined with the base of oil, or taken internally mixed with water. Be sure to read the application, obviously, and ingestion methods of the oils that you choose, as some are too potent to be applied directly to certain areas. So, of course, use caution. It's important to buy essential oils from a company that you trust and have investigated thoroughly. There's a great disparity in the purity and efficacy of low quality oils versus those that are skillfully and meticulously grown, harvested, and distilled. The following oils are some of the best in dealing with pain. Wintergreen. The wintergreen plant is the only plant in the world besides the birch tree that contains natural methyl, um, uh, salicylate, salicylate, sorry about that, uh, the main ingredient in aspirin. It was commonly used by Native, Native Americans as a general pain tonic. Research proves that wintergreen oil has a cortisone-like effect and is able to relieve pain quickly. It has anti-inflammatory, analgesic, and anti-spasmodic properties and therefore is often effective against headaches, muscle pain, and stiff joints anything you would use aspirin for actually. It's important to note that wintergreen is one of the strongest essential oils and should never be consumed. It is also unsafe for children and those with a history of epilepsy. Spruce. The essential oil of the spruce tree is aromatic, sweet and refreshing, and has been hailed since ancient times for its ability to relax the body and center the mind, as well as to ward off infections. It's a potent immune system stimulator and has been successfully used to ease arthritis symptoms, rheumatism, low back pain, bone pain, and sciatica. Spruce essential oil can also stimulate the adrenal glands, which offers a boost to the entire body. Lavender. One of the top favorites of essential oil enthusiasts for relaxation and pain relief, lavender is also one of the gentlest essential oils on the skin. It is traditionally used to treat headaches, tension, insomnia, muscle strain, and various cramps. One study found that lavender essential oil used as part of an acup um, acupressure treatment helped reduce lower back pain by 39%. Walking speed and spine flexion in the back pain sufferers were also improved by this treatment. Lavender also aids the digestive system, therefore relieving many types of stomach discomfort and has antiseptic properties that naturally help um, help wounds heal. On top of that, this delicious smelling oil can help to relieve the mental distress caused by mood swings, anxiety, and depression. This effect has been demonstrated by studies to be beneficial for, for women in labor, 
by helping to alleviate pain that stems from anxiety and fear. Cancer hospice patients have also shown improvements in depression and, and a sense of well-being following treatment with lavender essential oil. So as you can see, essential oils are very important and uh, again, another therapeutic modality uh, that I use in my programs uh, with my clients. So again, if, uh, if you need any help, if you have any types of aches and pains, uh, let me know and I'd be happy to help you out. Thanks a lot and have a great day.